When the last standing tree on the face of the earth will be cut down, when the last river's water will become poisoned, when the last fish will be caught only then, human beings will understand that they can't eat money. Viewers, climate change and global warming are among the biggest concerns of our time. I wouldn't be mistaken if I labeled them as the biggest concerns. Rising temperatures of the earth, rising sea levels, bushfires in Australia and the Amazon are all because of global warming. According to a Kuwaiti newspaper, last year the highest temperature recorded in Kuwait was 63 degrees Celsius, under the shade 52 degrees Celsius, and under direct sun 63 degrees Celsius. We can't withstand the harshness of 40 to 50 degrees. Now you can imagine what impact these 63 degrees will cause. My purpose of starting this channel is to create awareness among people about the importance of trees. Along with this, I want to discuss all those topics which somehow affect our environment or which somewhat and somehow makes it better. Earlier in the video, I talked about 52 degrees Celsius under the shade and 63 degrees Celsius under direct sun. This 11 degrees Celsius difference is because of trees. According to research published in a science journal, if we plant the amount of trees equal to the area of the United States of America, we can reduce CO2 from our environment up to 25%. Carbon emissions include burning of wood, smoke coming out from factories, and burning crop residuals. Trees won't only reduce this carbon, they will also produce oxygen, which will help us breathe in a healthy and better atmosphere. Another threat of global warming is rising sea levels. Experts express their concerns that if sea levels kept on rising at this speed, in the next 80 years most of the cities will be underwater. Cities like Miami and several islands of Australia and Japan. I want to share a strange fact with you that the Maldives, which is an island country, is importing sand and throwing it around its islands because it's sunning slowly day by day. If today the Maldives is drowning, tomorrow it could be Karachi, it could be Sicily, it could be our city. If today Asia is drowning, tomorrow it could be Africa, it could be Latin America, and it could be Europe. In order to tackle this problem, we must start doing things which make our environment better and should stop doing things which have bad effect on our environment. Through this forum, we will discuss ideas and will share information with you on how we can save our planet and how some people are already trying to save this planet. Stay with us. We will meet soon.